what we've been given is a farce. And uh, we deserve better than that. Uh, Craig Bartmer. I'm uh, an ex-New York City police officer. I was on the, uh, I got in the job in 1995 and I worked until uh, February of 2002. Uh, I was real close to Building 7 when it fell down and uh, running away from that sucked. Uh, that's one of the things that I live with all the time and uh, I don't know but that didn't sound like just the building falling down to me while I was running away from it. Um, there's a lot of eyewitness testimony down there hearing explosions. I didn't see any reason for that building to fall down the way it did. And a lot of guys should be saying the same thing. Um, and I had heard a bunch of guys that I knew on the radio who were down there on the site and they were yelling back and forth to one another. I said, screw this, I'm not waiting here anymore. And I went out and I walked down there by myself. And uh, that was about just a little bit after five o'clock. And as I approached, came down, saw the big hubbub going on around build building seven, walked around it, saw a hole. I didn't see a hole bad enough to knock a building down though. I saw, you know, yeah, there was definitely fire in the building, you know, but um, I didn't hear any you know, I mean, maybe this is movie crap. I didn't hear any creaking or I didn't hear any, any indication that it was going to come down. And all of a sudden, the radios exploded and everybody started screaming, get away, get away, get away from it. And I was like a deer in the headlights. And I looked up and it was nothing I would ever imagine seeing in my life. You know, the thing started peeling in on itself. And I mean, there was an umbrella of crap seven feet over my head that I just stared at. I think I know an explosion when I hear it, <laughs> you know? The Office of Emergency Management was in Building 7. That was a hardened bunker built to withstand just about anything that New York would face. You figured they didn't find the bunker in the pile. Yeah. If it, I mean, you know, if it was a progressive collapse and the floors crashed down onto one another, you think there would have been some resistance to the 22nd floor. That, that, uh, that building was, had a lot of important shit in it. <laughs> financial records, Is government you records. Know, do you have anything you know specifically? Specifically, no, I don't. Um, but, you know, I mean, we, everybody knew that was an important building downtown. You know, the security in the building was pretty serious. You didn't fuck around in that building. Um, and great, but so far I, I don't believe it. Yeah, when you were there? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it was. You ran from it. I ran from it. That 15-story pile of rubber, rubble that I saw, you know, I would have liked to have seen a good investigation as to why that happened, you know? Um, so, yeah, I want to know what took that building down. I don't think it was a fire, and it certainly wasn't a plane. Um, um, I'll ask any official at the Pentagon what the f*** are you trying to hide? If, if, if a guy...
fly that plane into the building. Um, and the Pentagon people with their cameras can find you on their property and kick you off in X amount of time. Mm -hmm. They can show me, a, you know, a couple of tons of steel slamming into the building. Flying over a suburban area first. There's something with that plane on it, and you can't tell me that those eight frames or, and the, the video that they released later on with a little bit more than eight frames that had a, had a cone of something and then an explosion. I mean, yeah. you can do better than that, and you're not fooling anybody. I don't know. I'm mad. <laughs> I'm really mad. Uh, I think we're being lied to, and the only thing, to, the only answer to uh, get to the bottom of that lie is a uh, new investigation. I think that the 9/11 uh, Commission report is a farce. I think that uh, the members that conducted it have conflicts of interest directly relating to uh, not just our government but corporations. Intertwined, intertwined with our government. Uh, I think it's farce. I think we're being lied to. There's not a word in it about Building 7. Mm -hmm. Why? It doesn't even mention that it exists. Right. Right. I mean, if, uh, if controlled demolition theories are correct, which I, I hope to God they're not, to be honest with you, but investigate it for real. Oh, wait a minute. You can't do that. There's no steel to test because <laughs> it's all been shipped off to China or uh, melt it down into something else. Freedom is the only way. Yeah. Terrorists, your game is...